Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for showing up for another Magic Review. That's what I do. I review the latest and the greatest. The latest and the greatest tricks. I want you to have all the information so that you can make great purchases, so that you're buying tricks that you're gonna perform and tricks that you're gonna love. Let's not buy any more tricks that end up in a drawer, right? Let's, let's stop doing that. <laughs> let's stop wasting our money. Let's buy tricks that we love, tricks that will perform, tricks that fit our style, right? Absolutely. Speaking of style, I'm wearing my Magic Orthodoxy apparel t-shirt. It's my logo tee. You can find it down below in my Teespring store. Just any one of those pictures of the t-shirts, click on that. It'll whisk you away magically to uh, Teespring and show you some of the other Magic Orthodoxy apparel shirts that you can find. And any one of those purchases uh, helps me out, helps the channel out, uh, keeps us going, supports me. Thanks so much. Today, we're going to look at Frost. Frost is a trick from Mikey V and the other brothers. It's all uh, sold under the Abstract Effects brand. And so what is Frost? Frost is a way for you to do the plot of having a deck of cards, having a card selected, signed, returned, and then the entire deck goes blank. Entire deck goes blank on the front, entire deck goes blank on the back, and the only card that's showing is the spectator's signed card. Now, I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. You're thinking mental photography deck, right? Mental photography deck, uh, which is a little re reverse. Mental photography deck starts off as a blank deck, right? You, you start that trick talking about, oh, this is how the cards come from the manufacturer. They start off blank and then they get printed and you show blanks in the front, blanks in the back, and then with a flash, the deck transforms into a full deck of cards. Frost is the reverse, okay? Frost is mental photography deck, rewind okay the deck starts off as a full deck okay full deck front full deck faces spectator sees that spectator has a selection they sign return and then the deck turns blank front and back all right let's say you pay your 35 dollars to hocus-pocus.com what are you going to get it's a little uh, closure bag uh, done in a very it feels like frozen Frozen 2 graphics, right? The color scheme of Frozen. And then inside that, you're getting a fully gimmicked deck. Fully gimmicked deck. Is it what I thought? No, it's not what I thought because I had mental photography deck and that one was screaming out in my brain. And that's rough and smooth. That's the same as, you know, an invisible deck. Uh, same kind of plot as that. There's no rough and smooth here. No rough and smooth. In fact, there's no gimmickry or movable things or mechanics or parts or whistles or bells or mirrors. There's nothing. This is, this is just deck of cards. It is a deck of cards printed from bicycle, thrown into a box, handed to you. There's nothing extra. It is, it is a deck. It is just printed in such a way that it gives this illusion and you're able to do these effects with it. That means, is it inspectable? Absolutely not. You cannot hand this deck out at all. This is really kind of like a fan effect where you're fanning the cards and showing them blank, fanning them and showing backs. There, there's a lot of opportunities here for flashing. So angles wise, yes, how are the angles? You could flash. You could flash if you are not, um, if you're not that good at fanning. I would say somebody who's a good person uh, at fanning, you know how to fan well, uh, th th this is right up your alley. But if you miss fan, there's a good opportunity that you could flash. What's the overall quality and production value of the video? Uh, your download video is 35 minutes long. You got Daryl and Daryl, they're seated on an orange couch, one camera shot, no music, no mic, large table in front of them. As far as what they're gonna teach you, they'll give you an introduction to the deck, they'll do a quick handling, they'll show you how to do the transformation really quickly. They'll go over the setup of the deck. Then there's a longer tutorial on showing the deck blank on both sides, and uh, they go through the entire trick, and it's gonna end at the 26 minute mark. After that, Mikey V comes in, he explains some of the history behind the deck. He, he's gonna mention mental photography deck, but like I said, it's you know the opposite of it. And then he's gonna offer you a bonus transformation, a bonus move. Uh, it's kind of like his take on the Erdnays. Is it well-made? Hey, it's United States Playing Card Company. Uh, mandolin backs, not bicycle back, not rider back. These are mandolin backs because 
the back design of the rider back is a copyright uh, picture. And so as of right now, Bicycle doesn't allow you to manipulate the back or change the back in any way of the rider back. So we'll see how that goes forward with Cardamundi. We've heard there's been rumors that Cardamundi isn't gonna be as strict with that rule uh, going forward, but for, for what this trick is, it's mandolin back. Pocket space, it's only a deck. It's only a deck, there's nothing else, nothing to add, nothing to take away. You know, the only uh, way perhaps you would need more is if you were gonna do a deck switch. Do a deck switch uh, for an all blank deck you know, and that way uh, it could be handed out. How much practice does it require? Like I said, uh, being good at fanning would be, would be a big help. So you gotta, I think it, it really is gonna help you uh, if you're good at fanning, okay? Uh, that is really gonna help you. It's also gonna really help you if you know how to do the Erdnase color change, okay? It's also gonna really help you if you know how to force a card. All right, so how much setup and reset is there? Uh, it is a deck stack, but it's not a hard deck stack, okay? It's not difficult to do. Uh, most of the cards are completely identical. So there, there's nothing like you have to remember where the, you know, the four goes here and the six goes here. Nothing like that. You can set this up on the fly. Positives, all right, so what are the positives? Hey, this is a great solution. It's a great solution to uh, the entire deck goes blank, right? There, uh, there's even been a, a cheat way to make your deck look like it's all blank just using a regular deck, right? And this is kind of like that, kind of like that, but done to like the 100th scale, like 100th degree, right? This is, this is that same idea, but to the max. So uh, it's a beautifully printed deck too. The cards are really beautiful. So, and, and just the fact that it's not rough and smooth so that, you know, when you show the fan, your spectator is able to see a nice clean shot of, you know, pretty much every card instead of like with rough and smooth, the, the cards are way too thick and it kind of doesn't look like a full deck. So you get a nice full deck look uh, with this. Negatives, I've already gone through the negatives. Negatives is, it's, it's, it's a one hit wonder, right? It's a full deck, 35 bucks, and it really only does one trick, right? It does one trick. The cards aren't examinable, they're not examinable, and you could flash and kind of ruin the trick. Is it worth your money? It is $35, 35 bucks, and the video is 35 minutes, so it's a dollar a minute. Dollar a minute and you get the gaff deck. Please, uh, Think about some of the things I've said. Uh, maybe watch another reviewer. Uh, Tyler Lunsford also did a review for this. Go check out his review. Chinese Magic Reviews, they also did a review for this. Check that out as well. Always get a second, third, or fourth opinion before you spend your money. That's everything I can say about Frost from Mikey V, Other Brothers, Abstract Effects. I got this promotional copy from hocus-pocus.com. If you'd like to purchase that for yourself, I would strongly recommend you head down over there and pick one up. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.